going to be doing the Holly Jolly Holly. <laughs> Holly Jolly Holiday Tag. I love Christmas. Merry Christmas to everybody that celebrates. If you do not celebrate, it's still holiday cheer and happiness and a happy day. Do you guys love my headband? I hope you guys can see it lighting up. Like, it is light. I was tagged by Nicoletta XO. If you guys want to see her tag, I will leave that linked down below. Let's go! Favorite Christmas movie? I have too many to name. My all-time favorite one is probably like Christmas with the Cranks. Four Christmases is a great one. Elf used to be my favorite, but I watched it like countless amounts of times. That it's still a great one, but it's no longer one of my like faves. I go to. I watch it every Christmas, so I've already watched it this year. I watched Krampus yesterday, and that's probably one of my new faves. Jingle All the Way with Arnold Schwarzenegger. Christmas in Wonderland. I'm not sure why I love that movie so much. I just love it. And the whole thing is based in the West Edmonton Mall, and I love the West Edmonton Mall. Are you on the naughty or nice list? Obviously, nice list. Right, Sans? Show us an embarrassing Christmas card photo. We know you have one, okay? Um, first of all, I wish that I had one. Every single year when I was a kid, I would always beg my parents, can we please get Christmas photos done? Can we please do it as a family? We can get like matching outfits and go together or like wear the same thing. I don't know, like I always begged my parents for one when I, like my whole time growing up, teenager, young kid, even adulthood. And my parents are just like, no, like that's not our thing. Like we don't get pictures done as a family. We never have, I don't think we've ever had any type of group family photos unless it was at the Vancouver Aquarium. You know those like photographers that like, oh, we can take your picture for five bucks. That's where it starts and ends with my family Christmas photos, or I should say family photos in general. So I wish that I had one, but I don't. When I have children in the future, yes, we will have one every year and we'll, I'll show you 100%, but I, I unfortunately don't. I, I would show you guys my most embarrassing one or all of them, but I don't even have one to share. Ugh. Have you ever had a white Christmas? Now this means snow and yes, every single year, I've had a white Christmas except one year we went to California for Christmas, so that Christmas was not a white Christmas. But yes, I live in snowy Saskatchewan, and yes, every single year. It's actually snowing today. I think it's because Santa's on his way here tonight, so he's bringing some snow for all the children. My background's failing. <laughs> Where do you usually spend your holiday? With family. We wake up in the morning and like disperse ourselves between all of our families so that we can see everybody for the holidays. So we stay at home and then we go to other people's houses. I love going to my parents' house, I'm basically there the most at Christmas. Oh, Play or sing your favorite Christmas song. Shawty with you. Under the mistletoe. Oh, wow. The wise men follow the stars. The way I follow my heart. <laughs> Mistletoe by Justin Bieber. I love that song. It's not a traditional song, but it's one that I love the video and it's just so like soothing and calming, but still like uppity. Love it. Do you open any presents on Christmas Eve? Ugh. Yes, and I don't really like to. I don't know why I've always been like that. Even as a little kid, I'm like, we're opening one on Christmas Eve now. Cause I kind of want to save them all for Christmas day. I don't know, like I've never really been about presents. I've always just been about like, let's just spend the time together. Let's go see a movie. Let's go like see the lights or something like that. Like save the presents for Christmas day. I don't know. Like I just, I, I don't know. Dalton loves it. He loves to give me a pres present on Christmas Eve as like a preview. That's his like tradition. I will appreciate that and accept it and love it, but I'm just like, man. <laughs> Can you name all of Santa's reindeer? Of course I can without editing out this question. Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, Donner, Blitzen, and Rudolph. Everyone's always like, there's eight reindeer. I'm like, no, there's not, there's there's nine. <laughs> and I think the reason why I remember it is back to question number one, what's your favorite Christmas movie? Jingle All The Way was my favorite one growing up as a kid, the one with Arnold Schwarzenegger. And um, there's like a radio station phone in for the toy that his son wants. And if you can name all of Santa's reindeer, then you get the prize that like this like sold out doll. So the whole way he's like Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vix, a Comic Cupid, Donner, Blitz, a Dasher, Dancer, Prancer. like he's saying it over and over and over again the whole way. So I think that's why I know them so well. But Rudolph is another one. What holiday tradition are you most looking forward to this year? Oh wow, there are so many. 
um, everything. Like, I love Christmas and Fam Jam. I think it already passed what I was most looking forward to, and that's going to the Enchanted Forest. So it's basically like a big light show. There's different like light things set up, things move, all the trees are decorated, all this to the, all to the top. And we go there with Drew and Shay. Well, I go there every year. I don't even care who I go with. Well, I do. But like, I just try to say like I go every year no matter what. And that's what I like most look forward to because that gets me so excited for Christmas. Is your Christmas tree real or fake? It is fake. I don't want buggies in my house and I feel like my dog would pee on it and the cat would like go crazy over it. I, it would smell super good when you walked in your house like pine. I do eventually want a real tree. If you guys want to see the video of my boyfriend and I setting it up together, then I will leave that down below. Hands down, what's your all-time favorite holiday food and holiday sweet treat? Food is my mom's seven layer dip. As just as it says, it has seven different layers in it. And I like sit down and eat that whole thing every year. Like it's by myself. I'm like, mm, do you guys, no, bye. There's like other dips for y'all to eat. This one's mad. Holiday sweet treat, I have too many, but jam jams are one of my fave. It's basically like a gingerbread cookie with jam in the middle pressed together. It's very simple, but the longer they stay together, the more like soft they get. Or if you first get them, they're really crunchy and those are in between. Oh my God, they're good all the time. Be honest, do you like giving gifts or receiving gifts better? When I was a kid, obviously I 100% loved giving or getting gifts much better but now as I get older I much much prefer to give gifts I'm the person that like people like, give me a gift I'm like oh and then I kind of like set it down because I'm like watching everyone else and then I have like a pile of gifts I'm like oh my gosh like I gotta open because I just like to watch people I don't know I like to watch their reactions and even if they're not even opening my gifts like I just want to see what other people gave to other people so to speak and I'm not just saying this for YouTuber to be cool or to get you to like me like that's honestly 100% legit but of course both are great <laughs> Show us your tackiest Christmas attire. I have quite a few. This is one of them. This Merry Christmas bow. It's massive and adorable. But this is the one that I got at Urban Planet yesterday. It's basically like a Santa sweater. That's all it looks like. It's a Santa hat on it. So I guess that's like one of my ugliest, but it's cute. Like I got so many compliments and it's warm. What would be your dream place to visit for the holiday season? Okay, I like that it didn't say for Christmas because for Christmas, I always want to be at home. I've spent Christmas away one time in California away from, you know, my home. And I just felt like, eh, like it's not really Christmas, right? So I'm glad it said holiday season. And that I would say New York, all the decorations. And I feel like just downtown would be the best place everything's gonna be so beautifully lit and especially in elf like you just see all those huge christmas trees and beautiful skating rinks and i think that would be my dream place to visit for the holiday season does your family have a special holiday recipe you like to help make my mom is very anal about her being in the kitchen and the only one because she doesn't like like even when i was a kid she doesn't like anyone helping and i've seen that with like Dalton's mom and stepdad, they like their kids to help, but my mom's like, no, bye, I've got it. Like, even when my aunties go over her, my mom's like, oh, that's very nice that you want to help, but maybe you could do dishes after, right? But I just, she likes her stuff done how she likes. <laughs> so I never really made anything with my mom because she's just, I like to do it, you're doing it wrong, bye. Like, she's very OCD and kind of like anal about it. Are you a pro present wrapper or do you fail miserably? Definitely fail miserably. I, when I, you know, some people like measure out how much wrapping paper and then cut it I'm like mm. like and it's like sometimes the the wrapping paper is like like curved like that and like jagged around the edges and I just glue it because they're gonna open it anyway like I don't know like all mine are terrible most memorable holiday moment when I was a kid I was approximately 10 years old and we were going on our way to the enchanted forest to see the lights that I was telling you guys about almost like sparkles and glitter in the sky and it was like moving around sort of like northern lights ish but very weird and then my mom looked up and she said to me and my brother like there's santa santa's in the sky and me and my brother were just like what and we looked and it was like something like unexplainable almost like there was like glitter and sparkles and it wasn't just snow or like reflections like you could clearly see it like this the sky was pitch black and it just happened it kind of like swooshed by and me and my brother were like oh my god we saw that now we gotta sleep he knows if you are sleeping, we're like, oh, we're trying to sleep in the car. What made you realize the truth about Santa? What truth? The truth that he is awesome? Do you make New Year's resolutions? Do you keep them? Um, I would say no. I don't, I don't know. I just always make resolutions for myself, even in May, June, anytime. I'm like, oh, like, 
you know, this month I'm going to start doing this. I just kind of make them all the time. If it happens to be on New Year's Eve, that's awesome. If I make them in July, then that's awesome. What makes the holiday special for you? Family, health, happiness, less stress, lots of food, and just happy, fun times. And those are all the questions. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it for you guys. And let me know if you guys like the backgrounds, changing them up. I know it's quite mixed. Some people really love it. Other people are like, no. But some people that love it are like, please, please keep it. It's, it's a very nice change. Um, I did buy a few more, so it's not just like the solid black. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and having a very Merry Christmas and a great day. And I will talk to you guys all tomorrow. I love you guys. Bye, cuties.